Hi there, my name is Grace. And my name is Patty Ann. And we are the founders of the Social Innovation Bootcamp. Uh, so the idea was kind of thought up, I would say, back in September when there was so much going on in our world. And I found COVID-19 was an opportunity in which a lot of inequities were highlighted. Um, and that kind of got me thinking about the many different problems that are happening in our world right now between racialized violence and climate change and the impacts of COVID-19 on many different groups. And so I kind of thought about how can we engage the student population in, in responding to these challenges and how can we have conversations about it with, with the student population. So I called it Patty Ann and we decided to come up with an idea and you can maybe expand on that a little bit more. Yeah, for sure. So Grace and I both agreed that we were super fortunate to be able to come back to St. of X, especially during this global pandemic. So we wanted to try to figure out a way that we could show our gratitude and appreciation to the larger Anakinish community that has supported us students in getting back to campus. So we decided to um, incorporate into a four week social innovation boot camp with four different workshops that we spoke to community development and social entrepreneurship and social change. So throughout the four weeks, we had 16 students that were very engaged and passionate to work with us. And so each group um, decided to pick a vulnerable population or community partner in Anakinish in which they could give a holiday care package to. Um, so they went out in the community, they supported local, um, local shops, and then will deliver their holiday care packages to the community partners. We wanted this program to be an opportunity for students to learn about the financial inequities that are present in our province. The students were able to engage in a workshop with the president of the Anti-Poverty Coalition to learn about some of these inequities that are right in front of us. In fact, the students were informed that this region of Nova Scotia is home to the highest poverty rates in all of Canada. Additionally, with the help of the RBC Future Launch Accelerator, the students were given a set amount of money within their groups in which they were allowed to purchase the products that they were going to give to the vulnerable groups. This required them to learn about budgeting and consider how fast money can be spent when just buying the necessities. Hi, my name is Sophie Soller. And I'm Samara Whitman and here, we are here with the Social Innovation Boot Camp. The Social Innovation Boot Camp has been an amazing experience to allow St. Evac students to connect with the Anaganesh community further. And it's also allowed us to learn more about poverty and what poverty means in the community of Anaganesh and the greater province of Nova Scotia because we as students aren't particularly exposed to poverty, especially in, um, on St. Evac's campus. So have you guys been working on a project in particular? Or is it? Yes. So. Our mission for this four week boot camp, so we only have four weeks, one hour sessions each week. So within those four weeks, we have to come up with a kind of like game plan to help communities in Anaganish that are in need. And we need to do it in a way that is not just like throwing items at certain groups, assuming that they need it. We have been in contact with certain groups, like my group's doing um, a certain society and we went directly to them and asked them what they need and then we're going out getting the items and then personally dropping them mm -hmm. off. Yeah, I can also can speak on what my group is doing. Um, we had mentors with the Social Innovation Boot Camp um, from different areas around campus. Mine in particular was from the Pathy Foundation and she essentially explained to us uh, the differences between helping somebody and helping yourself to look good by giving something to somebody. So what we have really emphasized with this program is asking groups what they need and not assuming what they need. Um, what that means for my group is we went to the Kids First Center in Anaganish and we asked them what they need to operate more efficiently and what they need, in, especially this Christmas season, because that's kind of um, what we're going off this year. The Social Innovation Boot Camp came at an amazing time uh, during the COVID season because it allowed CNEVEC students to look beyond themselves. In COVID, we're very isolated and it's hard to see what else is going on beyond what we're dealing with. So this um, program gives us a chance to expand into the community and address bigger issues outside of ourselves. This is sponsored by the Centre for Employment and Innovation and also um, an active CNEVEC.